Hi there and welcome to Land of the Knuckleheads episode 16. You know, in this one I've got a, a special topic I wanted to cover and it's called Get Your Face Out of Excel. What the heck does that mean? Maybe you've worked for a manager that spends more time in their office with their face plastered into an Excel spreadsheet and a computer screen than out in your work area. You ever dealt with that? I'm guessing you have because technical managers have a tendency to feel very comfortable with analysis and computers and their office space. In fact, that computer in their office becomes their comfort zone. And unfortunately, the more time they spend in there, the less time they spend where? In the work areas that they're responsible for. And the challenge with that is the relationships that they form with employees start to drift away. And before too long, people kind of look at that manager and don't know who they are, don't really trust them, don't I mean, respect even starts to go if the manager's really bad at staying in their office. Now, you as an employee, are there things that you can do to help your manager if they have their face stuck in Excel too much? Yes, there are. I've got a couple of pieces of simple advice that I want you to consider. Number one, invite them into your work area. Don't just meet in a conference room in the front office or in their, and even worse, meet in their office. What I want you to do is invite them into your work area. Go walk your facility once, once in a while, even if it's just once a month. Just have them come through your work area and as they're going through, introduce them to the employees if they don't know them or just say, hey, you remember so-and-so? And look what he did yesterday. Now, this presumes that you're in a lower level leadership position, certainly. You don't want to be presumptuous and introduce your manager to your to employees if you're not their supervisor, you know what I mean? It gets a little complicated there. but. It's really important that you give your manager many invitations to come out into your work area. Another thing that you can do, if you do need to meet your manager, meet them in your office, in your work, in your cubicle, in a conference room, in your area. Now, how do you do that? Well, here's the thing. Before they can invite you to a meeting, invite them to a meeting. It's that simple, guys. If, if you're inviting them to a place, you get to set the context of where the meeting's gonna be held. I guarantee you that most cases, they'll just show up. They won't realize that you're actually helping them. So a couple of simple things that you can do if your manager's got their face stuck in Excel. I'm not saying give them advice, not saying give them feedback. I'm just saying you need to give them the opportunity through action to get them out in your work area in a safe and effective way. So invite them to your office, invite them to your work area, and get them a little more engaged in the process in doing so. That's it for episode 16, Land of the Knuckleheads. Thank you, lead well.